our Jebu Egusi, we need Egusi. We also need, this is pepper with um, tatashe. We call it um, bawa and um, real hot pepper. <laughs> and this is our Egusi. We are packing them to wash the ego seed inside the bowl because you really need to wash them so this is the ego seed inside the bowl i'm preparing this for a party that i'm attending so wash it you make sure you wash your ego seed thoroughly because some ego seed are dirty but mind you this our ego seed i'm not roasting it so that i have to watch very well most times it comes with that and you have to make sure you thoroughly wash your egusi don't just take your egusi and pour it so i've washed the first set that is the second set that's how you see the water is so clean then egusi is now being packed inside the bowl me to take and grind the egusi This is, I've washed the pepper, the onion, and the egusi. You don't need tomato when you're cooking your ijebu egusi. Now it's on fire. I added water, then I added uh, enough palm oil inside the water. I'm using a firewood to cook this egusi party. It's actually for party. Now, I'll make sure I cover it and I like to boil. This is the grinded egusi. You can see it's well grinded with enough water inside the egusi. I'm going to mix the egusi. I'll make sure I mix it before I pour it on the pot that I've already put on fire. I'll make sure it is well mixed together. So this is the pot on firewood. And these pots, as you can see, the water and the oil, they've boiled together. You can see they have really mixed very well. And I'm adding the egusi. You can see I'm going to add everything. Really, you add the egusi. Try and make sure you mix everything so that the egusi will not settle on one part. If it settle on a particular part, you're going to have seed in your egusi jebu. So I don't want this egusi jebu to have anything seed. So I'll make sure that I make sure everything is properly mixed together. You have to make sure you add enough water. It's enough, if you add enough water, it's going to make your egusi ball properly. is how the egusi is going to look like so i'm going to cover it up for the egusi to get boiled I'm going to be adding the pomo first because I really want my pomo to get very soft inside the soup. So when they're eating it, it's not going to be a very hard pomo. So the first thing I did was to add the pomo inside. That is the cow skin. So that is going to get very, very soft. <music>
you are using your firewood as often as you can. You have to make sure you adjust the firewood because as you use the firewood, it's going to get smaller. That is the wood. So you try and adjust the fire uh, the firewood. <laughs> Can you see is boiling? Wow, you're going to love it. really boiling and so i'm going to be adding my ogiri jebu this is ogiri jebu so i'm going to add ogiri jebu to the boiling egusi soup so sorry you can't really see so much but just little you're going to add it into the egusi and you're going to love the taste because ogiri jebu gives your egusi a unique taste if you really know you are preparing egusi jebu it has to you have to add your a goose uh, ogiri jebu now let me tell you something ogiri jebu is different from ibo ogiri but this one is jebu's own it gives your egusi a wonderful aroma and the taste is going to be so unique It has really boiled so well, as you can see it. It has really boiled so well. You are cooking your egusi, please. The mixing, you have to continue to mix it. You don't just leave it on it and cover it and go away. You have to open in, um, just some minutes and make sure you mix your egusi jebu. Then I'm going to be adding my... At this time, you can add your salt. If you add your salt at this time, you're not going to have any lumps in your egusi because you really want it to be so watery and you don't want to see any lumps when you're eating it. That is the purpose of cooking egusi. It's different from when you're cooking um, egusi that is going to have lumps. If you don't want it to have lumps, you don't add salt at the beginning of your egusi soup and you make sure you you can only add your salt, uh, anything that has salt or your fish, that is after the egusi has really boiled very well. The egusi is ready, so I'm going to be adding my cat smoked fish. Now, this cat smoked fish, you can see I've washed it and I still have to soak it inside hot water so that it's if it's still too long in, in, on inside the soup, it might get it's going to just scatter. So I just have to use hot water to soak it a bit to get a little bit soft because it's not going to stay so long on it after I've added the fish
when I'm adding my fish, I have to make sure it's one by one. You don't just pour everything in. Once you pour everything in, your fish is going to scatter. You're not going to have that fancy because the now the egg is really, really boiling. So you just have to have your fish just one by one so that um, your fish is not going to get scattered. so much for watching my video don't forget to subscribe and like this video if you're watching Ojo Lakpe for the very first time come you to my youtube channel you're welcome and if you're a returning subscriber i say thank you for always watching my video to support my video thank you thank you thank you thank you so much sorry i didn't invite you to this party actually i had this party at Ijebu, and we are eating this egusi with a biripo a biripo is a popular yoruba Ijebu food and if you don't know how to prepare a biripo you can check out on check out on my youtube channel where i prepare a biripo Ijebu. Wow, as you can see, our egusi idebu is ready. Just bring your plate, bring your pot, and come and enjoy with Ojola Pay Space. This egusi idebu, we are enjoying it with this fufu. The fufu is ready. They prepared the fufu. Can you see? This is the fufu. This is idebu fufu, so soft, and you're going to like it. And it's not just with fufu. Anybody that does not like fufu, you're going to be taking our. This is our ebiripo. It has already been prepared, and you will go for anyone you prefer with our egusi soup. Thank you so much for watching today's video. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share till i see my next video bye bye